Tesla's CEO, Elon Musk, realized he had to shake things up at Twitter to allow freedom of expression, which he achieved with his aggressive but generous $54.40 offer to buy Twitter. Many say Twitter investors would benefit from a company that is losing money and plagued by fake users. Elon Musk now has more influence on the social media platform he may use to communicate with his supporters. On April 25, Twitter's board of directors approved Musk's $44 billion offer, paving the way for the billionaire to buy the company and take it private. How will this affect Tesla shares? Will the stock price rise or fall? Make sure to stick to the end to find out. According to informed sources, Elon Musk is preparing to take over as CEO of Twitter, at least temporarily, following its purchase of the social media giant. Tesla shares fell about 7% as a result of this news, due to Musk's devotion to Twitter, which may become a distraction from his already hectic schedule as CEO of the electric car maker and space company SpaceX. Many are skeptical about the CEO's purchase of the social media platform, claiming that Musk's shakeup of the board and management, as well as a re-evaluation of CEO pay rates, could jeopardize Twitter's business model. Indeed, the amount of time spent on social media is dwindling. As a result, Facebook, Instagram, and Snap all compete for the same amount of user attention. The Tesla CEO may have to choose which company to focus on. This increases the risks for Tesla shareholders. For months, the dispute between Musk and Twitter has been widely known. Now that a deal has been reached, investors will pay closer attention to how Musk's purchase will impact their portfolios. The ramifications are particularly serious for Twitter contributors and users. Billionaire Elon Musk made a $44 billion offer to buy Twitter, which the social media company accepted. If the deal goes through, investors in the social media and technology sectors will face a very different landscape. Twitter will go private, which means financial and operational openness will be severely reduced. Musk also hinted that significant changes to the user experience may be on the way. The billionaire, who has 83 million Twitter followers and has gone around the network hurling insults and jokes, has declared numerous times that he wants to transform the platform by encouraging more freedom of expression and giving users more control over what they see. By taking the company private, Musk can operate the service away from the prying eyes of investors, regulators, and others. Twitter shareholders will receive $54.20 in cash for each Twitter share they own, if the deal is completed. This means a cash infusion for shareholders, especially those with a large number of shares. However, the most important considerations are whether and when the acquisition will be completed. The sale was approved by Twitter's board of directors, and the company entered into a definitive agreement to be acquired by an entity wholly owned by Musk. However, the deal is not completed yet. The purchase must be approved by Twitter shareholders at the company's next annual meeting. Finally, regulatory approval and other closing conditions must be met. The acquisition is expected to be completed later this year, according to Twitter. Tesla shares fell after the agreement was revealed on Monday, indicating market skepticism about how much time Musk will commit to Twitter after the acquisition is complete. According to Zoe Gillespie, investment director at Bruin Dolphin, the decline in Tesla's stock prices reflects investor concerns about Musk's diluted presence in the electric car company. I think investors are wondering whether Tesla's board depth will be brought to Twitter, and whether it's just a short-term issue until the ground is settled, she said. The market did not view it favorably. We believe this is because there are concerns about whether the deal will affect Tesla's top executives as well. Analysts appear to sympathize with Tesla shareholders, who fear the Twitter deal will tarnish the company's name, according to Wedbush analyst Dan Ives. The deal, which would boost Musk's collateral-to-debt ratio, is far overpriced, according to Mike Rhodes, CEO and founder of London-based consultancy Consult My App. The Twitter deal may seem like a bridge too far for Musk. In a recent interview with Fortune magazine, he said that the projects he works on at Tesla and SpaceX cannot be described as unambitious duties that require little more than passive management. One can only assume that some of the previous vitality he instilled in those projects will be lost in the process as he embarks on another arduous journey.
According to Rhodes, if Musk chooses to focus more on his new project, Tesla and SpaceX may lose some of Musk's appeal, which could happen. It leads to decreased performance or decreased stock prices. Is the value of Tesla shares really in danger? Recently, Tesla stock was trading down about 9%. Elon Musk sold about $8.5 billion worth of Tesla shares in three days after announcing the Twitter purchase deal, according to Kevin Kaiser, a financial expert at the Wharton School at the University of Pennsylvania. The sale of Musk's shares indicates that the Twitter acquisition is likely to close because it shows that Musk wants to get paid. We believe Musk is being cautious by selling shares now, rather than when the acquisition is expected to close, according to Kaiser. It makes sense to sell a stock before people expect it to happen, so that selling it does not put unusual downward pressure on the price in the short term. Surprisingly, the revelation of Musk's sale documents over the past two days has had little impact on Tesla stock's performance on Wall Street, despite it falling nearly 12% over the week recently, and shares are up more than 3.4% at the time of writing. It traded at around $907.50 in New York, while Musk's purchase of Twitter is great for Twitter's existing shareholders, it enhances the risks for Tesla shareholders, according to Richard Windsor, founder of research firm Radio Free Mobile. He said there might be some management roles, but frankly, if you look at Tesla and what it's likely to do with Twitter, Windsor doesn't think there will be a lot of issues. However, Windsor, who claimed to be the last person to suggest Tesla was properly valued, said that if Tesla's legendary CEO were less involved in the company, the stock's value could stabilize. According to experts, Musk is also taking a fair amount of risk by using Tesla stock as collateral, even if his 2018 pay arrangement only allows him to exercise options at $70. On paper, he is the richest person in the world. If the electric vehicle manufacturer's shares fall unexpectedly, it could cause a lot of upset. Windsor agreed that it is important to remember that Musk used part of his Tesla shares to arrange financing to buy Twitter, and that tying Tesla shares to the deal poses a new risk to Tesla stock prices. According to Susanna Streeter, senior finance and markets analyst at Hargreaves Lansdowne, Musk faces tough, time-consuming work at Twitter in the coming months and years, with government crackdowns on big tech and revenue preservation likely to require his focus. However, since Musk has repeatedly dodged blows to his overambitiousness, he is sure to emerge bruised no matter what obstacles he faces. But in terms of combat, it appears that Musk wants a big say in how the company operates, which could put him under time constraints. Kathy Wood of ARK Invest is very bullish on his purchase of the social media platform and seems to believe that striking a balance is not too far off. Instead, he concluded that an Elon acquisition would be beneficial for Tesla. According to analyst Roger K. of Endpoint Technologies Associates, Tesla's stock price is unlikely to be harmed in the long term and may soon return to its previous level, according to the financial expert. Twitter is a great challenge because it's also an established company. K. claims that it's not about turning it into a successful platform because it has already proven itself to be a successful platform. He only uses Twitter as a platform. Analysts are trying to figure out where Tesla's long-term prospects point because of the deal. However, Musk is well known for his intense work ethic, which includes sleeping in Tesla's production facilities and working alongside his colleagues on assembly lines. While Tesla and SpaceX have had some of their busiest years in history, when it comes to Twitter's CEO role, it appears Musk may be pulling his weight if he accepts new responsibilities at Twitter. However, it remains to be seen what Musk's ultimate role as interim CEO will be. We believe Tesla stock's performance depends largely on how Musk handles the entire situation and whether he effectively balances all of his roles. How do you think Musk's purchase of Twitter will affect Tesla stock? Comment below.